morning, everybody. I hope you're all well and looking forward to the end of the year. And if you've started exams, that all is going well. Um, we are in the process of creating a couple of lessons um, to try and assist you in developing um, yourself further as well as your lesson bank. Now, um, we're starting with foundation phase. So the first one that we have done is the solar system. Uh, just so just to give you a sneak peek here, we have brought in a video. Um, and just a reminder um, with one of the tools. So if I was to play my video, um, what you can now do is actually take snapshots of your video. So just a reminder of that feature that's now available. So if you select it and you simply select your little icon that says snapshot, um, I have now taken a snapshot of my of my video. I can then move the video out. I can annotate that over that. Um, okay. We have also then brought in obviously just a picture of the planets, facts about the solar system. Now, of course, if you um, if you using your clever touch, you can obviously bring up your highlighter and you can highlight. Bring in your laser, and you can let you know um, uh, annotate over anything. Um, we've brought in a PDF, so here we can now go and um, go through the facts. So you'll see here it shows my PDF. Go through the facts, go back out, and I can move on. So here is an interactive um, little game. So the little ones can now come and match the planets. To the to their spaces um, here again a little more advanced now they would have to come and start labeling so simply just move the labels across again so bringing in a code breaker so you would get them you either use the dice um, so just a reminder where we find our dice so you would go into insert you would go to content I would go into my browse section um, I would go to my maths and I could now bring in my dice if I wanted to um, if we if we wanted to do use dice to count or you can bring in your counters so if I go here I can bring in counters however you want to teach your young young kids to then start um, with arithmetic okay um, so we've brought that in then of course lastly we've got story time so we have brought in a um, EPUB that you could then read out or have the kids read out as well. So we are developing these lessons in the hope that these will help you. If you have some ideas or some themes that you would like, um, please just <clears throat> pop us an email and let us know or pop me a WhatsApp. Then um, over and above this, the Clever Touch team are constantly working on offline content so if I just open a new page here <clears throat> we have got some great new features so or great new offline content or elements <clears throat> um, they have gone and created um, some South African or African animals as well as South African Namibian and Botswana currency so if you are teaching how to add um, if you're teaching money and how to add and subtract we have now brought in those three additional um, <clears throat> Uh, elements as well so what you would do just a reminder how do I bring in my own offline content I would go to options I would go to content you will see here I have got um, a, a file already in here but what I would do is I'd go add extra content folders go to wherever I have it saved um, so I think I have them in links I have it in content and yeah I would bring in my South Africa file Okay, so let me just stick on content and I would say select. So now I have brought in my links content. So what that would mean now is if I go into my insert, I go to my content, um, my browse section. So also just remember everything, sorry, just take a step back. Everything in your content has to be toggled to the right that you have access to it here. So then what I would do is I would click on content. There's my South Africa content. I'll go to my animals. Here we go. I can now bring across my hippo. Um, or I can go and I can bring across um, my 10 rand, whatever it is. 
Okay, so now this would allow you to um, to bring in these elements again completely offline. So for our schools who are battling with connectivity, this is a great feature. Again, if there is a request and there's anything that you would like um, to be available offline, please just pop me a WhatsApp. We are here to support you. We are here to ensure that your technology is working for you. Okay, so obviously this is um, at the moment we've we've brought this in for for our primary school, but again, high school um, educators, if there's something you desperately feel it's missing, please reach out to me um, and let me know. Thank you so much.